Hi, my name is Tabata Lanyani. I'm currently working as a business sales consultant, uh, sales and marketing, uh, my background, but I come from a hospitality background. I used to work for Zoho Sun, I used to work for Legacy Hotels. 12 year work experience and currently right now, as I said, um, uh, freelancing and the like. And uh, on the side, I actually do art. I got approached actually on LinkedIn uh, by some lady who said I must actually bring my pieces through uh, to their gallery in Santon. So I'm thinking that after I'm done with these pieces, I'll just showcase them before I actually just put them up on my wall. Um, I re I'm really not hoping to sell them, but I hope that one day somebody can actually love them to actually get to own them per se. So yeah. Ironically, I sold my first painting last year. <laughs> it was by mistake. A friend of mine came through uh, with his friend and uh, they saw my African piece and then they just loved it and I just got offered cash right there <laughs> on the spot. I was so shocked. It was literally two months after the pandemic started. You know it's funny? We all draw. That's the thing. We all draw. We all draw differently. You don't need to be able to draw in many minutes to be an artist. You can just uh, play with paint. You can just play with backgrounds. You can just draw trees the way you want to draw them. It's really up to you. It's really up to what you see. I believe everybody is actually quite creative if they actually just took time to study up um, their skills per se. So it's not a specific thing that you can actually just go to school for. You can definitely go to school to, uh, to polish up your skills. But however, whoever just plays around with a pen in a meeting, drawing a little bit of a tree or bunny or whoever, is an artist. You know the school stress that you get? That's the time you should actually just be painting. That's all I can say. <laughs>